All right, YouTube. Once again, it's Kennard Vernon Stewart here for the podcast talking the Auburn football. Go ahead and subscribe to Vernon Speak Sports Auburn. And as always, it's great to be an Auburn Tiger War Eagle. So Auburn picks up another recruit. This is actually going to be their third recruit of this recruiting cycle, 2023 recruiting cycle. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Also like this video. And of course, get the comment section rolling. So now Auburn has three commits, uh, one of which the best one on the list right now is Jeremiah Cobb. Now, Jeremiah Cobb is a guy uh, running back out of Montgomery Catholic Preparatory School, of course, in Montgomery, Alabama. He went on a couple of visits. It was getting a little iffy. He went on a couple of visits, uh, went to Clemson uh, to visit went to Tennessee, actually naming Auburn, Clemson, and Tennessee among the top three, but finally makes the commitment to pursue his college career in 2023 at Auburn. This actually means a lot for Auburn. Um, so far, out of the three guys, the worst ranking is 89%. If Auburn can keep this thing rolling, get a couple of offensive linemen, things of that nature, then Auburn can find themselves in in a, in a lot better shape uh, moving forward. I think this is a huge gain for Brian Harson. There have been some questions as to his recruiting abilities. Um, I, I I don't think it's a such thing as you can't recruit. I think the more of the such thing is, do you effectively recruit? And I think Brian Harson is is continuing to make an effort to show that it's possible that he can effectively recruit in the SEC. Um, as a matter of fact, like I said before, Jeremiah Cobb was in the mix to possibly go to either Tennessee or Clemson. Those were his warm, his warm uh, prospects. So what does this mean for Auburn? This actually gives Auburn even more depth at the running back position as it is a possibility that Tank Bigsby could be declaring to play professional football next year. Also, it'd be nice for Damari Austin and some of the other guys that, that actually are in the backfield for the Tigers. So I think this is a huge gain, not only personnel-wise, but for perception purposes for Brian Harson. Uh, this was a short video, but let me know what you think. Go ahead and like this video, comment, and subscribe to Vernon Speak Sports Auburn. And as always, it's great to be an Auburn Tiger.